Hey everyone, it's December 27th, and that means that if today's your birthday, you shared with Mexican serial killer Juana Barraza, known as La Mata Viejitas, or the Little Old Lady Killer, who murdered at least 11 victims in the early 2000s, and that is her right up there, and I'd like to apologize for the terrible Spanish pronunciation in this video. Born in Hidalgo in 1958, Barraza was sold at 12 years old by her alcoholic mother to a man for three beers. He repeatedly sexually abused her, causing her to become pregnant and have four children in all. Her one escape from her horrible upbringing was her love of lucha libre, Mexico's famed style of professional wrestling. She pursued the sport herself, wrestling under the name La Dama del Silencio, or The Silent Lady. She organized many matches and tournaments and was a fixture in the front row at wrestling shows held in Mexico City. Barraza had well-founded resentment towards her mother, and that transferred to other women. Beginning in 2003, she acted on her hatred of other members of her own gender. Women aged 60 and older in and around Mexico City were being killed in their homes, usually strangled to death. Barraza would approach older women and pose as a government worker offering assistance to gain access to their home. Once inside, she would use electrical cords, scarves, stockings, or a stethoscope she carried with her to strangle the women. Police were at a loss, likely because they couldn't conceive of a middle-aged woman being a serial killer. A sketch artist was called in by police in 2005 after she was seen leaving the home of a murder victim, but their drawings were circulated with a note that the killer was a cross-dresser, so they were pursuing a man wearing women's clothing. As a consequence of this, a crackdown was held on trans prostitutes in Mexico City that yielded no leads in the murders. They did at least find fingerprints at the scenes of 10 killings, and when Barraza was found by a lodger leaving the scene of a building where the landlady lay dead, she was arrested. Her prints matched those found at the scene, and she confessed to one murder when she was apprehended. After a lengthy trial, she was found guilty of 11 murders, though it is suspected that she killed as many as 49 victims beginning in 1998. Barraza's story has been featured in multiple TV series and in a documentary on Discovery and Espanol called Instinto Asenio, as well as on the investigation discovery show Deadly Women. If this is your birthday, I hope you have a great day. Leave me a comment so I can wish you a happy birthday. If you know someone whose birthday it is today, send them this video so they can find out all about their birthday twin. And to Juana Barraza, I say, happy birthday, you bastard.